For the first time since 2015, the Oregon State Beavers have picked up a win on the floor in Pauley Pavilion. A 10-point win for the 10th ranked Oregon State Beavers over the UCLA Bruins. I'm Anne Marie Anderson alongside Tammy Blackburn, and it wasn't without a lack of effort. I tell you what, Anya Ware was fantastic. Anya Ware settled in, and she started to figure out what Oregon State's defense was giving her. She was a bit timid at first, but she softened up, lightened up, and made things happen. And that turnaround jumper continues to be absolutely lethal for Anya Ware. Nobody being able to slow her down, but it, nobody can slow this player down, at least for as far as I can, can, am concerned. Destiny Slocum, the point guard with great handles for Oregon State, breaks down defenses, lethal crossover, and how about her as a finisher at the rim? How about her as an assister to Michaela Pivik? She was fantastic, and Destiny Slocum was feeding her all night. Her assist to turnover ratio is impressive. Eight assists, only three turnovers. She knows how to handle the ball. She's made every player around her better this season. Pivik is an even better player than she was last year. She was superstar last year. Pivik with some big points. Destiny Slocum, the leader of this team, at 56% field goal percentage. That, that will do it. 50 points in the paint, 19 bench points, only two for UCLA. I mean, when you're shooting 56%, it's hard to argue that. And so Oregon State, a win against UCLA. They'll head over and play the Trojans on Sunday, and the Ducks will come to Pauley Pavilion.